Aqua. Welcome back to the Cosmic Divine Tarot Baby. My darling, this is your How Is Your Twin Flame Feeling About You love reading for the uh, month of April 2022. Okay, love? Now, uh, well, let's just go ahead and see how they feeling about you then, Aqua. Well, all right then, baby. We're setting it off with the dark mirror, okay? Now, here we go. We got this card here. Boom, baby. It came out in reverse. That means your person is suffering. Aqua, I mean, they are suffering pretty bad, baby. It's like, uh, it looks like they're in servitude to somebody. And, and this other person that they're in servitude to looks like the damn devil, Aqua. Looks like this person, they're, you know, giving them bits and pieces and breadcrumbing them even worse than the way they breadcrumbed you, baby. Now, uh, uh... I, I don't know how, you know, they, they actually feeling about that, but it looks like they, I'm glad, that, I don't think they're feeling good about that, baby. Boom. Here we go. Uh, this person, uh, queen of my world, the king of my world. So, Aqua, love, if your person, you know, left you for somebody else who became the king or the queen of this person's world, baby. Uh, it looks like they left you for somebody who was 100% self-centered, okay? And and by this person uh, dealing with this individual here, only thing they can feel about you is that they want you to be the king and queen of their world, honey. It's like, it's like they, they got an imposter, baby. An impostor. all right? There's somebody just trying to be the king, the queen of their world. But it's like, baby... They are not you. Here we got this person feeling trapped right now by this individual. Uh, they may have even married the individual bride, you know, in a cage, Aqua. Or they may have already been married to this individual and stepped on the scene in your life acting like they were single. But in all actuality, they were not. They were, uh, you know, off the leash for a little while. Maybe separated from the one who they were married to. Okay, but it's like they tr they feeling trapped, love. They feeling trapped by somebody who was trying to be their king, their queen of their world. And this person uh, just making them do all types of things. Like just serve them 100%. Okay, baby? Let's go ahead and look into the erotic oracle. Okay, I see this person got the uh, purity of freedom. <laughs> of what they need freedom from this individual. It's like this individual right here is just making them feel like, you know, uh, that the only thing they can do is just remember what it was like to be with you, love to be, you know, where you were. Like this beautiful tropical island, this beautiful tropical, uh, you know, delightful place, okay? It's like they felt free with you. They felt that they can do and be who they actually were. But with this individual, uh, baby, they, they, they feel like... um. Uh, you know, um, sweet sobriety of feelings, Aqua. It's like their feelings for you, you know, after they sobered up, because I'm thinking this person probably was doing some type of, uh, you know, drugs, baby, had some type of addictions, maybe alcohol or, you know, they were smoking things they didn't have no business doing. But now it's like with this individual, uh, I'm thinking that this individual kept them or is keeping them in some type of servitude and trap because of those addictions, baby. Okay, so it's like now they got sober, Aqua. 100% sober. So it's like, baby, they're putting on their clothes here. And it's like, uh, what they plan on doing? Okay, see, they took a bath, took a shower, and now they're putting on their clothes. Here we got, here we got, uh, what? Uh, the muse living in my dreams. Well, my darling, that means this person is going to be coming towards you because it's like they just cannot get you out of their mind. It's like whatever this twin flame does, it's like you in the back of their mind, they cannot function. They cannot think properly without you, love. It's like only thing they imagine is, is just your, your beautiful booty butt naked body, Aqua. And, and, and it's like... um. They just remembering what, what you look like. They remember how soft your skin felt. They remember how beautiful your face is. And they just, uh, 
They just cannot forget it. So they putting on them daggone clothes and going to the muse that lives in their mind. That the person who had inspired them, the person who had uplifted them, the person who had really loved them, baby. Because they're not being loved right now, okay? Well, let's go ahead and get some um, romance angels. All right, love. Yeah, Aqua. Baby, I have been so tired and sleepy, Aquarius. I, I don't know what the heck's been going on with me. I've just been sleeping for hours and hours and hours. Hmm. But let's go ahead and see what the heck's going on with this twin flame right here. I'm we'll pull from the bottom, baby. Boom. We got an uh, engagement. So, Aquarius, it says that this person is trying to come to you because they have not been able to forget you, regardless of what they do. And it said, listen, your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Okay? So, it's like, baby, it's like, hey, you know, your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Aqua, this person going to try to bring a ring with them. It's saying, let go of control issues. Okay. Hmm. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. I'm thinking that right there is uh, the advice that you, that is being given to you, Aquarius. Just don't try to control the issue. Just allow the situation to unfold naturally. Okay, baby? Now we got this card right here. Calling in your soulmate. So Aquarius, it's like, you know, your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations bring or help bring you two together, okay? This person thinks that you are their soulmate, but in our actuality, love, you are their twin flame. Now, baby, this is what I'm about to do here. Love, I'm about to go into if your twin flame or all the signs that your twin flame could be, okay? It's like, you know, from Aries to... Uh, to um, Pisces, if your twin flame is uh, Aries all the way to Pisces, okay? Let me shuffle these cards here. One more shuffle, love. Okay. Now, let's see. If your, let's cut to that. If your twin flame is a uh, Aries, how they feeling about you? Bottom of the deck. Well, baby. Uh, it looks like uh, they have some type of regret here, okay? It's like this person has so much regret that they're about to come and just chase you right now. It seems that this person, matter of fact, has been chasing you in your dreams, love. Been chasing you in your mind. And the reason why they've been doing that is because they got some type of regret. Here we got the deck on five of... Um, Five of fire. So this Aries has some type of regret because they allowed for you to think that there was actually somebody who could compete with you. They may just think that there was somebody who could go ahead and, uh, you know, be the star too, baby. Okay, now here we got this uh, mirroring right here. And then they went ahead and went off to somebody else who mirrored them. And what this person did was make them feel like a daggone option. Fighting and fussing with them. Okay, so it's like, baby, it's like this Aries uh, wants you to um, come back so bad. They want you to come back so bad, of course, this don't make no daggone sense, love. It's like, Aries is like just in your mind right now. Aries is in your mind. How about that Taurus? Boom. We got the four of... um air here now the Taurus is uh thinking that everything is about to come to an end with y'all okay it's like the, the the uh the film is coming to a straight end you know what i'm saying but it's like you know i'm feeling like this Taurus is feeling like that so therefore they're going to come and bring a ring baby okay that's why it's on the engagement right here okay pull from the middle because they don't want that bad boy to end we got uh three of um earth here so this person is going to try to let go of control issues and uh go ahead and um you know, uh, get you on your knees, baby. You know, get your booty butt naked on your knees and hit it from the back. Uh, Aqua, you're going to have to be very careful with this daggone uh, Taurus right here. Because this person may go ahead and get you pregnant. Hitting it from the back like that. Or hitting the kitty from... Oh, my goodness, Aqua. Here we got the daggone four of fire, baby. So, uh, this Taurus, like, you know, hey... 
call they feel like you are their 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 soulmate. So therefore they're gonna come straight straight in and go straight for the kitty, baby. Gonna go straight for the kitty. Back you up. This person's clothes is ripped off right here. They're gonna just go straight for it, Aqua. So I, I don't know what the heck you gonna do about that, but you know, we got this whole uh Taurus uh going crazy. How about this uh Gemini? Bottom of the deck. Okay, Gemini is also regretful, baby. Uh, they just want to haunt you all in your mind right here with the eight of air. It's like it's on the engagement. They seem to be talking to you telepathically. That's why it's on the engagement right there. Telling you they're about to go ahead and put uh, a ring on it whenever they step back on the scene. But Aqua, they're not going to care if you're running from them because they're going to be running right after you, baby. Okay, now here we got the deck on Gemini with letting go of control issues. Uh, the, um, the two of fire here so love it's like uh this person just gonna step on the scene and uh they're gonna ask you to open up the legs and give them the kitty and the wand but it's like i don't know if you're gonna be doing that they're gonna or it's gonna be like they're gonna be waiting to see if that's something that you're gonna do baby okay here we go top of the deck uh, it's just something that's going to make them so happy. This daggone uh, Gemini Twin Flame. It's like they just want to uh, soar with you, baby. They want to take you to a whole nother level. It's like this person just, uh, like I'm saying, they, they just feel like you are the one. They feel like you are the one, this Gemini right here. They feel like you are the one that can make their dreams and their fantasies and everything come true, okay? Bottom of the deck for uh, Cancer. Ooh, Cancer. <laughs> Feels like they just need to come on the scene and, you know, just spank on the booty, Aqua. Oh, they want to just go ahead and, 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 and have you, you know, play all up in the kitty and on the wand while they smacking on the booty, baby. They just want to do all types of things. Kinky, nasty, freaky things with you, Aqua, okay? Let's go ahead and uh, get to the middle of the deck. Boom, baby. Ooh, they're watching you. Cancer is watching you like they're spying on you. They're trying to let go of control issues, so therefore they're playing like they're doing something else, Aqua. But in all actuality, love, they're just watching you. Top of the deck. Boom, baby. It seems like you got a lot of people who are your twin flames who was in regret, Aqua. We got this the third one, isn't it? We got, you know, somebody just haunting you in the mind because they're, uh, you know, regretful. They're They're very upset. It's like... They have been praying and trying to call you back in, Aqua. They just want to, you know what I'm saying, do all types of kinky, nasty things with you, Aquarius. Now, let's go ahead and go to that, um, who are we talking about now? We got Cancer. Oh, it's time for Leo, Twin Flame. Okay, pull from the bottom of the deck, baby. Leo is just walking around with all types of hot fantasies. It's like everything they see is red when they think about you. Leo is like, oh my goodness. They just, you know, thinking of all types of different ways that they could just come back in. And, and, and what they thought about is just giving you a ring, baby, okay? They're thinking about giving you a ring, but they don't know if that's going to work there. Okay, now let me see. Now, okay, so that's the reason why they don't know if it's going to work because we got the deck on set having a fire. This Leo made you feel like they had Linda, uh, Lori, they had, uh, you know, Betsy Sue over here and Karen's behind sitting on their face, baby. Okay, so they have all types of daggone, uh, uh, options here. And now, you know, you got your daggone defenses up because you ain't trying to deal with this, uh, Leo individual. Here we go. We got the, uh, mirror ring right here. So it's like, uh, this Leo has definitely looked in the mirror and felt like, really, they got to get you back, Aqua. Because the only thing they can think about is the kitty and, and the wand and the booty, baby. They're just looking in the mirror like, hey, Leo's like, you know what? I got to get my dad going Aquarius back. And and I don't care what anybody got to say about it. Now, how about that uh, Leo that we got Virgo, right? Bottom of the deck, baby. Boom. Okay, so Aqua, you tried to go ahead and sneak away from the Virgo with the aid of uh, water hair, or you think that you're sneaking away from this Virgo twin flame, but baby, you see that arrow on that tree right there, right? Oh, you ain't going nowhere, baby. It's like, no, baby, because you're not, but I don't know. What it say? Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. So you guys not escaping this Virgo. Oh, no, Aqua, don't think you're escaping the Virgo, baby. Middle of the deck, we got, oh, what did I tell you? Look, two of deck on fire. 
So Aquarius, this Virgo and open up your shirt and started sucking on them nipples, okay? And you didn't want them to suck on the nipples. And so you trying to close your shirt and walk away and look how they holding you to a water. Like, no, baby, this person is supposed to be letting go of control issues, but that's simply not what they're doing, is it? Now, here we got this, uh, and that's because they feel the ten of water with you. So they don't want you escaping anywhere without feeling their love and their passion and everything that they got for you. So it's like, no, they have been searching for you for far too long. And Virgo is not, it's just not letting you go, baby. Just not letting you go. Okay, let's go to that uh, Libra. How's Libra twin flame feeling about Aqua? We got, oh my goodness. Libra is out here looking for you, Aqua. They're looking for you, baby. They're like, listen here. Um, and they're being very threatening. People are, uh, you know, are, uh, you know, afraid for their safety with this person, you know, coming out there acting all big and bad. Because the only thing they think about is somebody, uh, you know, lifting up your skirt and, and being all over your booty. Okay, let's go ahead and see what happens going on a bit okay okay boom baby okay mm, mm, mm. yeah when they find you they have every intention on winning you back this is how that labor gonna look at you like baby i missed you i loved you please i just i just need you back I, you know i know i got control issues but baby i'm letting go of the control issues right here okay top of the deck okay we got this daggone mirror and keep coming out aqua now, you and the Libra, what y'all doing? Mirroring each other. Both of y'all want each other. Both of y'all thinking about the kitty, the wand, the booty. Both of y'all thinking about getting back into the, you know, between the sheets. And it's like, you know, you're just mirroring each other. What y'all calling each other back? I don't know, baby. It's like this mirroring just keep coming out right here. But Libra is like, you know, they, they're dying to get you back. Libra is praying, you know, calling you back, okay? I don't know what happened. Maybe you would have blocked Libra or something. Let's go ahead and go to Scorpio. Bottom of the deck, baby. Oh, Scorpio. Ace of Fire. Oh, so Scorpio just want to get you booty butt naked, lay you on your side, and just go ahead and give it to you like that, Aqua. Okay. Oh, they just want to give it to you like that, baby. Okay, they want to just go ahead and let you bite off a piece of that, give you their heart, do whatever it is that you want to do with you. They want to put you in a complete and utter ecstasy, Scorpio. Okay, here we go. All right, here we got this uh, nine of fire. Baby, I mean, the Scorpio, they don't care what you're doing, Aqua. They don't care what you're trying to accomplish. They don't care how busy you are, Aquarius. This person, uh, reaching right for the wall. They gonna come step on the scene, reach right for the kitty, baby. They, 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 what you got? Help? What you got in your hand, Aqua? It's a, look, baby. Bottom of the deck. They will fight you for that. Okay, boom. Let's go. Top of the deck. Okay, look. The world here, Scorpio, is coming across the world. They, listen, they ain't trying to hear anything anybody gotta say. They ain't told everybody to kiss their ass. Okay? They ain't thinking about nothing at all. They coming straight for you. Like, listen, uh, I. I have just been, you know, needing my Aquarius and, you know, I'm just not going to deal with somebody else taking Aqua from me. I'm just, I'm just not going to deal with it, okay? Just, how about, um, what we got, Sag A? Okay, Sag. I hope I didn't miss anybody. Bottom of the deck, boom. Okay, Sag. Sag want to do the same thing that Cancer wants to do. Just go ahead and smack all over the booty, okay? Just go ahead and, you know, hey, baby, you know, while you playing with the kitty and playing with the wand, this person want to go ahead and smack all over the booty, this uh, Sagittarius being all freaky with it. Okay, now, boom, because Sagittarius is feeling heartbroken and betrayed, all right? Perhaps they had a problem with control, and they needed to go ahead and let go of control issues because now they're just filling you any daggone way wherever they are you see this person's hand down in the kitty right so they just feeling you know last time you were you know having sex with them aqua last time they was having sex with you okay boom baby mm-hmm the daggone eight of earth. Yeah, this person wants to go ahead and just cement you in the bedroom. You know, this Sagittarius. They, they don't care what you're doing in that bedroom. But as soon as you get finished, baby, they're taking off this shirt. And they're going to work. Oh, they're going to work now. Let's see. Baby, don't you think that this Sagittarius is not going to work? This Sag is about to go ahead and do it and, and make it happen. Okay, now let's go ahead and go to, uh, what do we got, Capricorn? Okay, boom, bottom of the deck. Okay, chariot.
Oh, well, Capricorn just wants you to sit on the face. Oh, they want to show you one hell of a daggone time. They just show you off, baby. Like, hey, you know, we want to go ahead and take this to the next level. Uh, Aqua, I don't think you sat on my face enough. Okay, let me go ahead and show you what it feels like when you sitting on my face. This twin flame like here. Aqua, what, what, what you got, baby? Look, the daggone queen of um, air right here. Now, see, Aqua, it looks like, you know, they tried to go ahead and let go of control issues, but when you got up and, and you started putting your clothes on, they seen that booty right there. Baby, they just jumped up. They just jumped up like, oh no, where the heck you think you going here? We got the lovers right here. Took your clothes right back off. Well, this is how they feel and this is what they want to do. Take your clothes right back off because in their mind, they've just painted you as just the most beautiful, sexiest, loveliest, uh, you know, dynamic person ever. Okay, it's like you're just the most perfect person in the world to this daggone Capricorn. Let's go to Aquarius. Bottom of the deck, baby. Boom. Ooh, the high priest. So Aqua may just show about your spot, okay? They may just step on the scene. When they step on the scene, they're going to want to try to open up your legs, Aqua. So love, hey? Hey, baby. Uh, <clears throat> uh, Aqua, you may be coming home one day and see uh, your, your Aquarius there out on the daggone porch with their legs open. Okay, we got two right here. Uh, we got the dad going, um, eight of fire and the knave of water. So, like, this person is going to try to communicate with you, Aquarius. And it's like, you ain't even going to try to hear this communication. They're going to try to turn you on, make you, you know, what, make you all hard and everything. But then this aqua is going to be like, you know, it's like, that that ain't going to work, okay? They're supposed to be letting go of control issues. But look at this person got you over their dad going shoulder. Like, this booty, this kitty, this one, uh, belongs to me. I don't know what the heck you think you're doing, baby, but you think you leaving somewhere. Are you ain't going no dad going where this person queen of water. Uh they've been praying for you too and now they're gonna come to you all, you know, innocent and open and you know trying to tell you how they feel and being all sensitive and whatnot. Okay? They're gonna be all sensitive about it. Now <laughs> This Aquarius has never been this sensitive before, but now they're going to try to be this sensitive now, Aqua. So let's go to Pisces right here. Pisces. Bottom of the deck, twin flame. Okay, we got the deck going uh, seven of fire. So Pisces made you feel like an option too, huh? They had, you know, Paul, Mike, and, and Jason, and David's ass. Okay, saying that they were sitting on their face, right, baby? Just making you feel like, hey. But now this person wasn't trying to come back knowing that you got your defenses up. Like, you know what? I'm not even trying to deal with you, Pisces. Pisces bounce, man. I'm not trying to deal with you. Okay, it's like this person is trying to go ahead and let go of control issues because they feel that that right there will make you happy. But Pisces is not trying to let you go, baby. Aqua, you're ascending up uh, back to being the star that you were before you descended down here into this muck and mire, this BS. But Pisces is going to chase you, baby. Here we go. Three of that going uh, water here. Pisces is going to try to pull you back into the water, baby. Pull you right back into the water aqua so love i don't know how you know three of water you know they, like i said they made you feel like you were not even good enough for them right they made you feel like hey you know that you just was not the right one you was not the right match aqua okay now let's see what these people need to say to you right quickly any of them you know any of these twin flames is there anything that the twin flames need to say to you? aqua all right, let's go ahead and cut the deck here. All right, baby, pull from the bottom of the deck. Boom. Okay, they're like, listen, you are all I want, all I need. All I want, all I need, baby. Please just, please just don't leave me. Please just don't leave me, baby. Open up your, open your legs. I want to see you. I want to see you. I, I need to see you. Boom. Oh, listen, baby, take off your panties and come here. So it's like, baby, just like, look, at, look, look, baby. Now, now these people, this, this hot is all hell. Listen, please give me another chance to love you. Listen, I know I was controlling is all hell, but I just need another chance to love you, Aqua. Listen, now just take off your clothes and get in here. You're like, wait a minute, baby. I thought you gave up control issues, but uh, it's no secret you want me. What are you talking about? supposed to be letting go 
Uh, you got the blank hair for her. You know, somebody calling in their soulmate. This is twin flame, not soulmate. I love you. Can you stay tonight? Can you stay tonight, Aqua? It's like, baby, <laughs> let me see, let me see. Boom! Baby, young fools don't know what to do with it. It is the kitty, the wound, the booty, the heart, the soul, okay? I, I am not them. <laughs> So this person not like they're not no young fool no more. He's talking about, have you made up your mind yet, Aqua? All right, now, my darling, these are the things that they are saying to you. These twin flame, any one of them is talking to you like this, Aqua, because you're the moose in their head and they just can't get past, uh, you know, loving you. They need you, they love you, and I'm thinking they also want to probably trap you in the cage, want you to be the the the, the king and the queen of their world. But I, I don't know how you're going to do it, baby. I don't know what this person talking about. It's no secret you want me to just take off your panties. And have you made up your mind yet? Excuse me, excuse me. <clears throat> now, uh, Aquarius, I don't, well, I don't what you gonna do, baby? I mean, these people, hey, baby, they just, they're just coming in. They're coming in hard, and, and, and you know, they want, they want you. Hot as hell, baby. They hot as hell, Aqua. They on fire. Everybody wants you to take your clothes off. Okay, so I, I don't know what you're gonna do, baby. I, I have to get you next time, of course. I, hey, you know, uh, at people asking you, have you made up your mind yet? Mm, mm, mm. Mm. My darling. Well, it's very heated with the twin flame. Aquarius, I know you're gonna be like, uh, oh, you ain't gonna know what to do at first. Uh, but you you're gonna you're gonna make the right decision, love. You're gonna right make the right decision, okay? Uh I just gonna I'm just gonna leave it there because I'm gonna trust you to make the right decision, Aqua. You're gonna do the right thing. My darling, this has been your reading. If it resonated with you, then don't you forget to hit that like, share, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell notifier to know when we'll be uploading new messages for you. I know that I've been away for a while, Aqua, but like I said, I've been hibernating, baby, just sleeping. You know, something just... I was sleeping beauty, okay? I mean, I couldn't get the heck out of bed, all right? I don't know what you want me to say, baby. Hopefully, you know, I don't know if it's over yet. <sighs> anyway, of course, let me go ahead and let me digress. Baby, uh, if you want a personal reading, uh, the way to contact me will be in the description box below, all right? All right, well, love, I'm going to end this reading then. It's all long and everything. <laughs> Aquarius, peace, love, and light.